Hello everyone and welcome back to Project Ozone 3. Today we'll begin work on more automation of the crops and also some applied energistics, as well as getting into cities, Twilight Dimension, and Lordcraft so that we can continue making our farm. <laughs> our very, very big farm. So, today the first thing we're going to do is we're going to head over to cities. Now, I'm also going to address all the things that I've done. I don't know if I addressed this in the last video or if I did this in the last video, but... I did this, this magmatic generator setup, and did a whole bunch of ultimate universal cables hooked up to some farms. I've got the Inferium automated, and I now have uh, the wheat automated. Uh, I'm using a mechanism logistical sorter into ultimate logistical transporter setup because ultimate cables and wires from mechanism are just absurd. I mean, this thing can carry a dang lot of power so yeah um i also just now uh did this setup here which automatically crafts um some automatically crafts hold on i gotta craft a new inferium crystal because it is no longer making anything Cool, yeah, this automatically crafts up to uh, Superium because I don't want to, that's what we're currently working on like in terms of uh, other things. And if I want to go down a level, then I'll just uncraft the Superium. That simple. Um, so I believe that's everything I did. Um, it took a bit to get to, the, oh yeah. So I did, so grind, getting the, Ender chest to do that is really annoying, so we will be doing the blaze rod uh, seed because that's it's really annoying. We're just gonna do it because I think, in fact, I'm gonna do that one first. Uh, another thing that we need to do is we need to do, and we'll do this first so that we can actually get to that. We need to make a base essence ingot, which means we need to head over here because I've moved my inf my uh, inferior management over here. There you go. And now we can claim the psyllium ingot, which I did on my own. And we don't want that. We don't care much about that. Yeah. All right. We're going to grab the psyllium ingots from over here. And we're going to make a psyllium dagger, which I believe is... Ah, prosperity stick. Cool. There you go. We can throw that in there. All right. Now that we have this, we can head over here. And this is another reason why I did everything this way is so that I can easily, 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 easily just take out all of these guys. Not worrying about too much, though. I don't want to hurt the uh, golems because they will not drop anything. There's no point. Uh, also, we need. Did I already run out of space in this one? I did. I'm gonna need to make another. I don't have any iron. Oh. Thankfully, the iron plot is already finished, so we can blow through iron, and I don't care. Uh, so let's make another chest, another iron chest, just for. Loot bags, and oh my gosh, I don't know why. That wasn't lagging before stream, so stream is the issue. All right. Put that there. And yoink all these loot bags and put them in this chest. So that I have space to grab the, uh... Ooh, patient bag. Nice. Look, those things. That's what I want. Those zombie chunks right there. Um, and I need, I believe I need four. So we need to cool the masses a little bit more. Can't wait till I have an ME system so I don't have to manage all this. Um, but for now, super annoying setup. Yeah. 
Oops. Yeah, it took me a while to figure out the mechanism stuff because it was just kind of vague. It didn't really tell you at all what you're supposed to do, so... Here we got experience, creeper, and some zombies. But I think we need one more zombie and we should be good. Or... Oh. Um... Don't want that. Uh, or don't need it. Okay, I just need one more zombie chunk and I'm good to go. Of course, they are kind of dying immediately. Alright, I'm gonna get... Oh, hello. I'm gonna start getting rid of these guys. Because they are kind of blocking the area that I have. And the witches are really annoying. Okay, do I have enough? Yes, I do. And we will have a lot more as well. And I'll leave those in there so that I can... Uh, actually, let's leave one zombie chunk in there so that I have a space set and ready. All right, now we need to burn them. Throw them in here. Smelt them. And uh, yeah, there's going to be a lot more stone slabs to come because of all of that over there. All right, so now I believe we do what? Make them into tier four. Okay, so then we need to go over here, grab my superium, and I think the, yeah. There we go. Cool. There we go. Wait, was that a achieve? No, okay, cool. I was about to be like, oh no, I didn't have any of those touch my inventory. Um, base rods, right? We're just gonna do this like right away. We'll keep everything else in a the sorted setup, but for now, I really want to get these blaze rods going because they're my only hold back. Um. All right, and then the actual seed requires ah. There we go. And I believe I already have a plot to use. So we can put it down. Oh, and uh, I planted the black quartz, aquamarine, electrical steel, which will come in handy. Redstone alloy also comes in handy. Electrotine? Oh, that's weird. Uh, conductive iron as well. So blaze. Um, I need to uh, do a lot more plots offline. We'll make the seeds today probably, but oh boy, a lot more plots. Um, yeah, uh, I believe that's the only, what about the Enderman seed? Where is that one? Enderman, 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 it's a wither one. It's probably over here then. Gotta find it. It's a ghast seed. Oh, there it is. What do you require? Just two ender pearls? I could make it if I wanted to, but we're not gonna. We're probably gonna go through all of the mobs uh, at some point, but not right now. All right, now that we have that thing, we're gonna let it grow. Let's go put all this essence back in its place. We'll throw the blue in there, and then the green in this chest. That's the wrong chest. Yeah, 
it's this one. Yeah. Uh, thankfully, mechanism checks that the inventory of the thing is about to go to. We can also put the orange in here and get some more blue out of it. Yep. So these are, I'm using analog crafters right now. Uh, apparently they are a bit annoying whenever you leave the world and come back you have to reset them and stuff so that does sound annoying and I hope I do not have to deal with that um, another thing I did was I uh, I used the one nether star we had to make the unbreakable wand seeing as oh my gosh I'm gonna use a lot of the wand because I'm I'm happy I made it because like I said I will need it a lot as we keep on going out uh, cause there will be a lot of plots here. Cause we're like I said, we're not only doing um, what's it called the uh, I'm forgetting the name. We're not only going to be doing mystical ag mystical agriculture. We'll also be doing uh, other stuff as well. Anyway, so initially I was like, oh, I don't have enough of the skeleton skulls to use to do this. But then I realized that I can also convert other skulls into skeleton skulls using bones. So now we have enough skeleton skulls to go to the city's dimension. There we go. This is the city's dimension portal. Two block, two diamond blocks, a bed, and six skeleton skulls. Right? Right. Um. Uh. I'm fairly certain that it's that. Hold on. Let me look it up again um yeah I did the right thing takes a bit does it need to be nighttime do I need to sleep in the bed like actually sleep in the bed that's kind of stupid but okay um, mainly going there so we can make the nature seed I can get vanilla flowers as well from that little grass patch over there it's just way easier to get, actually go to a place that has vanilla flowers than to uh... yeah I think that'll do it yeah there we go Go. Um. Maybe I need to. They're all real skeleton skulls. Okay, hold on. This is bothersome. Let me. My city's portal in P. Oh, three don't work. And then thing happens to the thing. Lava crystal blocks. Right. I remember having to do that. I totally forgot about that. Okay, we're going to do that right now. Yeah, it's a stupid little thing. Doesn't I, I've had that happen to me before, and it didn't do anything. All right, let's head to the nether and go get some nether or lava crystal blocks. But real quick, is there another way we can make them? I don't know if it needs to be infused or not, though. That's the issue. If it needs to be infused, then we'll have to do that as well. 
I think the thing I'm looking at for uh, the guide to this is a different older version of Project Ozone. Oh, hello. Why is there a slime here? Like a normal slime. Um, I'll leave him alone for now. Uh, he'll probably die. So I'm not naming him Jerry. Uh, any lava crystal blocks down there? I don't see any down there. All right, we're going to venture over to where the nether fortress is that I have been grinding a ton of uh, blaze rods because those chests each need four. The seed needed 16, and it was not fun. I'll tell you that right now. Now, I can also use magma cubes. They drop um, the reliquary magma core or something like that, the heat core. Uh, and then you can use two of those to make, like, four blaze rods, which is nice. Um, but they they don't drop it that often. Ah! Frick. Uh, nothing here. I'm thinking about making a cobalt pickaxe, because I have a ton of cobalt that I've gotten lately. Um, I still don't see any. We'll go down further. It might be under the lava, if I recall. Pretty sure I did get it from over under the lava. Mm -hmm, that would have been bad right there. I have a little tiny path right here that I've made. Get to where I need to go. Hello, Wither Skeleton. And I don't want any of your items except that one. You kidding me right now, right? You kidding me? Come on. No, eat the food. Do oh, a good lord. Don't come near me. Don't come near me. Oh, I'm going to die. Alright, well, at least I got to a safe spot. Um, Alright, and I know what to do now. So, that was annoying. Uh, I might have to look up exactly where the lava crystals spawn. I'm pretty sure they're right underneath lava. If they are, then I could just bucket a whole bunch of that and uh, deal with it later. But I don't think they're exactly right under every single pot, patch of lava. There's like a specific generation point. That was a stupid skeleton. Oh, now there are blazes. Wonderful. Well, how do I get down there? F Phooey. Uh, I have to run through those blazes. My ghost thing is worn off already. No. Here we go. That was a bit stupid, I'm not gonna lie. And yes, I'm sorting my inventory right now. Okay, there we go. Um. Hi. I wonder if I can, like... Some emeralds. Actually, I need emeralds. I will take that. Um...
Oh, okay, I can't mind that. Thought I could. I might be thinking of the all the mod seven stuff. Um, I'm not seeing any. Uh. Ow. Hmm. Some more emeralds. I wonder if I should get twenty four for the emerald armor. It's not a bad idea. Uh, let's go up first. And I can just slash home at some point if I wanted to. Did I do that? I don't remember doing anything like that. Okay. Nothing there. This is going to be a bit of work. Uh, some diamonds. I don't need diamonds, though. Okay. Got hit by an ember. Um... I mean... Let me look it up real quick. Where can I find lava crystals PO3? When lava crystals block added by armor plus it's generated naturally between Y level 6 to 16. We're on 32, so let's go back to that cave that we found earlier and go down. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Spooky. I believe it was this way. Yeah. Hi there, friendo. There's nothing down there, is there? All right, let's go this way. This is dangerous, though, because we're in the nether, obviously. Six to sixteen. Okay, so we just need to go down to like ten, I guess. It's like diamonds. Oh, you know what? I have this. Hello, cave. How are you? Oh, also, I'm now using heat sand as my source of heat for the crucibles and stuff. Okay, this is looking promising to a degree. Alrighty. Okay. Tainted soil is really annoying. Oh my gosh. Come on. I'm gonna like excavate the entire layer of this area. I 
I'll take that much. Hmm. Oh, lunar ore. Yes, please. Here's spider, which is not good. Usually the spiders down here are not nice. Oh, I'm too far down now. This is good. Okay, you know what? Start throwing stuff in my backpack. That isn't related to... Ne that isn't netherrack, I should say. Probably should have brought an extra tool to use. Oh, emeralds. <laughs> Frick you. I hate the fake ones, man. That's so annoying. All right. Continuing on. Wow, that was a very concentrated amount of tainted soil right there. Why couldn't I put any there? Okay, since we're all on a viable level, is there anything here? Like... Nope! That's great. Guess I'll keep searching then. fine with it burning all those items or not apparently okay well the thing is, is this is being tedious now I don't know how I found it so easily on my old world And this is really, really annoying. I'll take that gold as well. Because I, I need gold. Oh, no you don't. I might have to, like, see if I can find a lower level. Okay, also I want those as well. I swear to God. Oh my gosh, there's so much soil as well. Okay, hold on. Go into the Reddit page. Yeah, it looks like... Okay, I'm going to slash home again. One, because my tools are about to break and I need to re repair them or replace them. Um, And two, because honestly, I don't think I'm getting anywhere. I don't need aluminum. I need gold. I don't need lead. I don't need copper. And I don't need tin. Okay. 
We'll just throw this in a chest somewhere. This one's good. All right. Uh, let's make another hammer and another pickaxe just in case they break while we're out. And then we will... I don't know, try and, try and find them. Because right now they're just being really, really annoying. I would love to find them, but I can't. Um, these tools are also expensive, which is annoying. Pretty sure I need to put another Inferium Crystal in there as well, so I might as well do that while I'm here. Where's... Oh, I put it all in here. Okay. I scared myself. Okay, we'll let that run while we're away. Actually, you know what? Uh... How many can I claim? Because however many I can claim, that's how large I'm going to make the... How, how wide and how long I'm going to make it. And then I'll just go by height after that. That's how many. Yep. Okay. So then we'll subtract a layer from that. And we'll go up one. So then... Oh, wait, did that even save? Yes, okay. All right. Now I know the uh, extent to which I can build this platform out, too. Because there's a ma there is a mount that you can actually claim before it's like, oh, no, 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 I don't want you to do that. I kind of plan on getting on... I don't know, I might do some all the mods. We'll see. Oh yeah, there's my crafting bench over there. Um, that was spooky. Uh, I guess the main thing I need to do is just to get lower and lower. Naturally, without going through caves or anything, just through the big open area. Oh. Hello. Oh, no. There's a lot of things here that I don't like. Embers. There's a gas. That's even more things that I don't like. We're down another layer, but we need to go deeper. Okay, where are you then further down? Fifty one. Hmm. Nope, I gotta go around. I 
which means I need more netherrack. Oh, wait, I have a wand as well that I could use. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Gosh darn it. Yeah, no, this wand is going to be very helpful. I want to get over there. Almost. Also, I wonder what that tree is down there. Looks interesting. What are you? Skyberry. Hmm. All right. How low are we right now? Not low enough. We need to go deeper. Unless it's changed for, uh, um, might be changed for project ozone. It could be a to higher evolution, uh, elevation, ele elevation. Blah, blah. Cannot talk. Ugh, I don't know why it's this hard. I was able to find them like really easily. My first world. They were right next to the fortress I had. There might be some over there. Oh, you know what? I'm fairly certain I remember them like being inside the magma blocks. That's a terrible little drop right there. What does my map look like? Very sparse. I don't like that. I don't, I don't really want to get near it, but I just blocked myself. Nope. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. No, nope. we're gonna try and get as far away from that guy as we can right now. Oh, okay, we might be in a good spot. More so, I thought. I'm out of food. Come on. Give me something here. This is a very similar area as uh, Frenderman. It's a very similar area to where I found them last time as well, so I'm hoping that I can see them. <sighs> right around the base of a fortress with magma cube. <clears throat> We're not getting near that thing. Nope, not at all. See, like this right here is ideal. That's where I remember them being. Is it gone? I don't see it. Nope, it's still there. Oh, please don't tell me it's aggro. Okay, cool. We're good. <sighs> I mean, like, where? Oh. 
Oh no. We're not dealing with the Black Widow. Those things in Minecraft, well, even in real life, they're just not great. <sighs> Whose idea was it to put it in Minecraft, huh? If it's, if it's as bad as it is in real life, who, who in the right mind would put it in Minecraft? All right, so I'm gonna go a different direction this time. This is like, this is a terrible hunt. I hate it. It's awful. I need like, how many do I need? I don't even know how many I need. How many do I need? Like 18 as well? It's quite a lot. And head back that way, but we're gonna go see if we can get to the other side of the lake. If I can get to the other side of the lake, there is a chance they could be over there as well. But if I can't get to the other side of the lake, then I don't know what to do, cause, mm, and even then, Hold on, let me look at it again. Nope, not Minecraft. Uh. Well, this guy's already in his practical end game and he's just yet getting to them. Which is really annoying but okay <sighs> they appear to be a very big nuisance to find okay really quickly um, I'm gonna go on hold while I look at my other world Okay, it's taking a bit anyway, so I might as well just... We're gonna... Alright. I just don't want y'all to see the uh, other world. I haven't actually used it in a while, but it's still more advanced than the one we're at. Which is funny, because I, I barely have any mystical agriculture going on. I think I grinded for, like, everything. <laughs> It took me a while. It's taking a bit to load in. Okay, there we go. Um, it is lava crystals. <sighs> okay. That's annoying. I don't like lava crystals. All right, we're going to work on... Uh, Something else. <laughs> not this. We're going to work on something else because I'll, I'll find them offline. They're not an actual achievement until later. They're for the armor, so I'll find them on my own because, um, yeah, they're a nuisance. Ugh. <clears throat> oh, another thing. I was researching the uh, monolith, the big as many as you can output formation 
Well, I mean, we're still in the nether. Might as well look around. Um, for the AE thing. And uh, I always wanted to figure out how you could get all the faces on it to work. Because obviously there's some interfaces inside the structure that I can't use. So I was a bit confused. Um, and it turns out there's a face, a type of, uh, or not a face, a, a type of bus called the P2P tunnel bus. And it's basically like it bypasses cables or something like that in a, a way, in a sense. Um, and allows you to uh, take a face through. Um, I guess the best way to explain it is that the P2P channel or the P2P thing, um, it takes 32 channels and condenses it into one channel. And then you can pump that through a cable however when you put it back to the face they uncondense an R32 uh, so you have to basically the bundle cables all they are and you can only do this once it's not like you can condense condense you can only condense once um, they basically just make it really really easy to use so you can send those 32 channels through another uh, cable to get the other. Hold on. To get the other uh, thirty-two. I'll have to, I'd have to show it to you with cables and stuff because it's a bit complex and a bit annoying to understand. And I'm not even fully certain myself if I've got it fully understood. Come on, man. Bleh. All right, I'll start moving down. I should probably make the hang glider. It would be of major use. Ow. What does it take to make the hang glider? Stick. Oh, it's just leather? Okay. That's easy to do. Uh, why don't we do that real quick? Alright, and uh, the way we can make leather... No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Right, that. Oh, okay. I just, I just need. All right. Uh, we'll throw these in a, this chest over here. Cool. All right. Let's head back. Then we'll use this thing because it's way better to use. And doesn't have durability, so. I should get the angel ring though at some point so that we can just fly around. Uh. Hey there. Yep, yeah, this is making it way easier. How many was that? Five. How many do we have now? 14. We only need four more. 
I'll keep the magma blocks on me. I'll probably need them in the future. Yeah, look, we're on Y level 34. They have adjusted it for Project Ozone 3. Ow. It's a very small patch of that that I fell onto. I might as well deal with these guys real quick. Got some reach with this thing. Doesn't look like there's anything over there, though. Alright, let's go back home and re-enter. Oh, it's on cooldown for another 10 minutes. Alright, then we'll build across. There might be something over there, I don't know. That's annoying. Just had the sudden urge to play Fallout. Don't know why. It's really weird. Alrighty, there's nothing here. Annoying. I don't know, it might be the menu music. Cool. We'll head back home. We'll fly down to another area and see if we can find more. We just need four more. And we're done. We'll throw them in the chest for now. Or not. Yeah, there's a big area over here. Yeah. Very large area. At this point, I'm just kind of exploring the nether because it's way safer to do it this way. Ow. I say that and then I do that. Um. 
Um, I just need like one or two more blocks of it. I don't need like a full on big vein. Come on. Oh, there's like a ruined portal here. Hmm. There's another one. None there. Interesting. There's a lot of magma blocks, though. There's a gas, I think. Come on. Oh! Okay, they kind of usually pop up over there on a very large flat. Oh, look, there's some right there. In all honesty, I want to try and get as much as I can. Fifteen. Now we're gonna head back up and glide down. And there's a lot here. Yup. Of course, it's right next to the blizz area, which is really annoying. Noise. 23. Or maybe those weren't bone or a gas, they're like a bone structure. Cool. More there. Okay. Oh my gosh, that was so close. Oh Lord have mercy. Ooh. That was more than I had anticipated. See some more over there. Forty. Four plus eighteen is twenty-two. Yeah. Uh, no, I need two more. Okay. Because at some point we have to make a lot an armor out of this, so we might as well get that enough for that. Nope. Nope. I'm not, not dealing with you right now. You're not my objective. Maybe later, but not now. Alright, that should be enough. So let's... Slash home. Alrighty, that was the goal of the stream. <laughs> was to get that. Or the goal of the recording, because we have just finished the recording. So, yep. 
I hate to do this, but gonna have to finish it the next time. Also, making the hang glider was a perfect timing thing because we will want it for this city's uh, world. All right, and I just realized I don't actually need waystone since I can just use slash home. All right, well, thank you guys on YouTube for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and to head over to Twitch and follow me there. I'll see you guys later. You have a great day. Bye.